Every summer, I visited my wife and children in Stratford. There I could settle down to serious writing, but my mind kept returning to Harry. Without him, the summer seemed like winter. Yeah. How like a winter hath my absence been from thee? The pleasure of the fleeting year. What freezings I have felt. What dark days seen. What old December's bareness everywhere. Pleasures wait on me, and thou away. The very birds are mute. Or if they sing, tis with so dull a cheer that leaves look pale, dreading the winter's near. The dark. But if that flower with base infection meet, rough tread, the basest weed outbraves his dignity. Mind you, I was no angel myself. Did you or didn't you? My only recourse was to a sonnet. Alas, it is true, I have gone here and there and made myself a motley to the view. Gored mine own thoughts and so cheap what is most dear. Made all offences of affections new. Cleared away from all. Befriends me now. Befriends you. As That's I by yours, you passed a hell of time. Gain the very Why should others' false adulterant eyes give salutation to my sporty blood? Or are my frailties why I frail as spies, which in their wills count bad what I think good? I am. That I am. The old ancestors was the Protestant martyr and saint, Sir John Oldcastle. Apis lapis. <laughs> Apis is Latin for B. Lapis is Latin for stone. Apis lapis translate as bead stone. Beeston. William Beeston. He was a friend of Prince Hans. Yes, and a Protestant martyr who was slowly burnt to death. Mm. Not much comic mileage in that then. These slippers are not mine. They were my son's, Horatio's. My son. What is a son? And what a loss word is considered true. Oh, but my Horatio grew out of reach of those insatiable humans. He loved his loving parents. He was my comfort and his mother's joy. The very arm that did hold up our house. Suckles round of pain and groan, and therein showest thy lover's withering as thy sweet self <coughs> grows. From his heart, dear fly, oh, that sad breath from his spongy lungs bestowed. Oh, all that borrowed motion, seeming owed. But yet again. Betray the fore betrayed. A new pervert, a reconciled name. Yes. Come on! Hey, can we get him on here? Some tricky one, but I'll give it a go. Angels! The carpometer is a box with a dial in front. Look at your. Zia! Paul! Kevin! Dave! Can I ask you a great favour? Will you forgive me for my bullying, harassment, and threatening body language? Of course we will. They have to. Goes for the territory.